Staying with BRIC countries, Brazil's third largest steel company, CSN, is looking to expand into the cement industry, and it has made an unsolicited bid for Portugal's largest cement producer, Simpor. We partner with the FT, the Financial Times, to bring you Lex on Bloomberg so you can get a sneak peek at the Financial Times' flagship column a day early. Richard Stoven Bradford joins us now live from London. Good morning, Richard. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, so a potential deal here in the commodity space for a Brazilian company. Absolutely. Um, cement is probably not the most exciting thing to be talking about at this time of the morning, but put it this way, um, CSN is making stacks of progress in Brazil where there's something of a construction boom going on and there's a housing shortage, but even so, it is looking to diversify internationally. Simpor will enable it to do just that, and don't forget we're talking about Portuguese speakers, so there's a synergy there straight away. Um, Common however, language it's and all. Offer a common language, exactly. So there's a start. But the other thing that Simpor brings it is access beyond Portugal to Portuguese-speaking former colonies in southern Africa. So Angola and Mozambique, and it's even got an activity in South Africa itself, as well as operations in North Africa. So this is good access for CSN to international markets. And we're taking a look at uh, Simpor shares. They're surging right now up almost 14%. Uh, to what extent is this a sign of Brazil really leveraging its, its currency, which the real, which has strengthened quite a bit? In fact, Noriel Rubini is saying that the real is overvalued now. Absolutely. It does look overvalued, doesn't it? And yes, I, the, offer, the offer price is actually at only about a 5% premium to Simpor's close last night. So it looks a little bit like a lowball bid. My hunch is that there are one or two other bidders it's trying to flush out here. And there's a, another interesting twist to this, that 17% of Simpor is held by the world's largest cement maker, which is Lafarge of France, and then 23% is held by Simpor's former chief executive, who is now who is still the chief executive of one of Portugal's largest construction companies. So, I guess that CNN, CSN is trying to get hold of that 40% block. It offers conditional on getting 50 plus one share, 50% plus one share in Simpor. Okay, thank you so much. I've been speaking with Richard Stoven Bradford over in London of the Financial Times.